Okay, so what we want to do right now today is to embed a 40 Ajax Framework dashboard object into our own little uh, dashboard page using Dreamweaver. Let's, so let's see, if I start to Alt-Tab right now, uh, we'll notice that my 40 database is running, and it is a web server. So, as we can see, if I go back to Firefox, we can see that the page right here, dashboard.html, is running off the web server. So what we want to do is we want to embed a dashboard into the little white rectangular box in the middle. So to get started, let's go to Dreamweaver. Okay, so there are three steps involved when embedding a 40 Ajax framework object onto an HTML page using Dreamweaver. You see, the first step is to import the structure, and it's that purple button that we see on the far left. Uh, when we hit it, we're asked to look for the support folder. So we'll click OK. OK, so what you see here is an alias for the support folder. It's actually pointing to the real support folder that's within the component. What's really important to note uh, for the macOS platform is that 40v11 components are treated as applications or packages. So you cannot navigate within them um, using this dialog box you see before you. So what you have to do ahead of time is to make an alias of the support folder and put it up top where you can find it. As you can see, the demo itself, it's a merged database, and right now that's grayed out, so we can't even go into there. So let's choose the support folder alias and tell us our structure is imported. Step number two, we want to insert the login information. Right now, if I use a username guest and the password 4D, I know that I validated that username and password um, in a developer hook on the back end. Uh, that developer hook is a DAX dev hook logging. So that will allow us to use 40 Ajax frameworks on our page. So I'll hit OK. And finally, the third step is to just click on the page in Dreamweaver where I want the object to be embedded and just hit what object up top that I want to embed. In this case, it's the dashboard. Okay, so in this little box here, we can select what dashboard that we want presented, and we can give it some width and height dimensions. I'll hit OK. So now we see that there's a little icon of the dashboard in that little white rectangular box. So that's where it should appear. So I'll save it, and I'll go back to Firefox, and if I refresh the page, we should see the dashboard appear right there. And so that's how to embed a dashboard object onto a page using the Dreamweaver extension.